Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. I'm saying good morning because it's morning here But I don't know which time of the day are you watching this video either way I woke up like half an hour ago and I just ate my breakfast I actually ate like toast and a coffee in bed because I was feeling extra extra lazy and then I took a shower brushed my teeth added some moisturizer and I'm ready to start this day. I'm going to put this right here so I'll be doing a vlog today and I know it's a little bit weird because I haven't done much vlogs in this channel so you're probably not very used to them, neither am I, but the truth is while I'm in quarantine I haven't been feeling like doing anything else. I'm gonna be honest just because I don't know, it's such a weird situation that I don't feel as comfortable doing like full outfit videos and stuff like that, it's just a weird feeling and I don't feel as comfortable to do this type, the type of videos that I love to do and you guys love to watch too which are the ones that I dress like celebrities or lookbooks and hauls because honestly I haven't been purchasing clothes at all actually I've been feeling like wearing just tracksuits and joggers and stuff like that so yeah this situation is very weird and I'm trying to do like the best I can so I decided to do a vlog because I think it's easier to show you just what I'm doing with my life. So I need to take some Instagram pictures, so I'm gonna take care of that. And I also want to make fluffy pancakes, those Japanese pancakes, you know, they're so thick. But first of all I need to do my makeup because I'm going to shoot for Instagram and I want to do a TikTok doing my makeup too. Also, let me just show you the outfit that I will be wearing today. So this rack over here is where I put all the clothes that I want or need to shoot for brands. But the one that I need to shoot today is this one. And I feel it's cool because it's very like comfy lounge vibes and it's the only clothes that I feel like wearing right now so okay so here is the outfit it's actually very very simple as you can see very like pajamas <laughs> but I think it's very cute and it's like the mood that I feel like wearing while I'm stuck at home still want to add some jewelry so I'm gonna do that now and I don't know what I want to do with this hair yet but I just put it in a ponytail so it's easy to apply my makeup and then I will decide and I want to add some earrings too. Okay, so I'm doing my makeup now. Some of you guys probably already know this, but I was going to live one month in Japan in May, June. And my flights haven't been cancelled yet, but we are currently in the middle of April and it's like a month left until my trip and I have a feeling that it's just not not going to happen because we don't see this getting any better so I think it's time for me to reschedule my trip because I need to face the truth and accept it there is no other way but yeah that's something that is getting me a little bit down lately that's what's been driving me crazy lately is having like zero zero idea of when it will be okay to restart our lives in a way but yeah we are going to make it somehow everything's going to be okay okay this is going to take forever so i will be back in a few minutes with my makeup done so makeup is done i took a little bit longer than expected doing tiktoks and before i noticed it was time for lunch so i really fast grabbed some leftover pasta from my fridge and heat it up and it was very tasty now it's time to take some pictures and I'm kind of thinking where I'm going to take them because I'm running out of ideas lately. Let's see what I can come up with. So guys, I just finished taking my pictures. I'm gonna leave the camera here again. Okay, so I just finished taking the pictures and I was very indecisive because I couldn't find like a place to take pictures and I decided to take in the kitchen and look like I was doing an activity so since I'm going to bake some pancakes later today I decided to take some pictures pretending I'm baking already the pancakes so when I have the final result I can take pictures of the pancakes and do like a feed sequence if it makes any sense I think in my mind it made sense and I kind of like how they turned out so it's like 3 p.m. now. I think I'm gonna do my pancakes around 4 p.m. so I can have them before it gets too close to dinner time. I'm going to do my mom's nails because she asked me to do her gel nails and I showed you in my last vlog the entire process so I'm not going to record that but I'm gonna be back in about one hour to make the pancakes. I'm gonna do some Instagram stories by the way. I don't know if this is boring for you but it's actually 
my work is this so it's what I do I'm gonna show you how I do my TikToks and Instagram stories usually I use this which is a pop socket and I have this pop socket holder here and it's glued to my window so I can have great lighting so I just put my phone here and here I am I can do my stories here I can do like I can record IGTV I can record TikTok so that's how I do it Okay guys, so it's now 4 o'clock, so I think it's the perfect time to start baking our pancakes and the pancakes I'm doing today is not like regular pancakes, it's souffle pancakes Why I can say it? Souffle pancakes or uh, the Japanese fluffy pancakes, whatever you want to call it So this is the first time I'm doing those pancakes and I watched some YouTube videos and they all differ in terms of ingredients because just like regular pancakes, everyone has its own recipe that works for them So I have my own that I usually do for regular pancakes and the thing in common that all these videos have is that they mix the egg whites separately so they get that fluffiness so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use my regular pancake recipe. So you guys are probably going to check how I do my pancakes now. But the thing that I'm going to do different is just to do the egg whites separate and then mix so it's more fluffy. I don't know, let's try this. So my pancake recipe is always two bananas, two eggs, half a cup of milk and you can use any milk you want and then I use five spoons of flour my flour it already has some baking powder and cinnamon this is like the flavors I like to use I don't add no sugar at all because I add bananas and they already have sugar so let's start this is a cool recipe if you have some bananas that are not looking that great because you can still use them for this now I'm going to add the half cup of milk is enough. Now I'm going to add the five spoons of flour. I really love cinnamon, so I'm going to add a bunch of it. You, if you don't like it, you don't need to add as much as I do. And now in a new recipient, I'm going to try to separate the eggs. I saw that some people have this weird swirl kind of tool to separate. I need to buy that because I do it by hand. I do it the old-fashioned way, just passing the yolk from one piece to the other. Okay, so now I'm going to start with the first uh, mix where it has all the ingredients and I'm gonna mix them with this. Okay, this is looking even now. I'm going to do this one but with this tool. So the egg whites are mixed and I always heard like the best way for you to see if they are well mixed is if you turn them around and nothing falls. Done. Now I'm just going to mix both together. Mixing all of this together and hopefully it will be like a creamy texture. So I always use this machine to make my pancakes and I usually use it in the maximum heat but today I'm going to put it like this because we want these pancakes to take a little bit longer to bake because we are going to be adding like layers. So this is how they look and now I'm going to put this to cover it just like this and wait for a little bit before I do like a second layer adding more layers now and as you can see they are pretty much holding the form okay now comes the worst part it's when I'm going to try to flip them okay first one pray for me it's very thick so I think I'm going somewhere with this I think so far so good, they are not the prettiest, but at least they look cooked and they are fluffy and thick, so... I decorated with cinnamon, a little bit of coconut and some Nutella, so let's see. He hates being on camera, so I'm gonna try to get a reaction without showing his face. So, you hate it? No, they are good. But they, they are, are a, a little bit uncooked, but they are good. 
Okay, I'm going to try it now. I never tried like the real Japanese ones, so I don't know if they should be uncooked inside or really, really cooked. I have no idea, but... It's definitely very different than what I expected in the pancake because it's a little bit more wet inside, like it has some kind of sauce, which is probably just pancake uncooked. But it tastes really good, so... I don't know, if you are familiar with this, let me know, should they be more cooked or are they just fine? So either way, I'm going to eat the pancakes while we watch Terrace House. So basically we started watching Terrace House, um, maybe like this weekend or something, and we already watched like a full season. Actually the season is on standby, so I don't know if it's going to end or not because of the virus situation, you know, because uh, Japan is also in quarantine now and this was being recorded at this moment, so I don't know how this is going to end. Um, but we are really loving it. It's like a reality show and we are kind of suckers for a reality show, honestly. Guilty pleasure. Um, but I really like how it's like a different culture, so you can have like a different perspective on like dating and everything because they have like really different approach on dating. So if you haven't watched it yet, I highly recommend it. It's on Netflix and I think I'm gonna watch it now while eating my pancakes and finish this vlog because after that uh, probably just will be relaxing and doing nothing interesting. So yeah guys, thank you so much for watching, I promise I'm going to be back with the fashion videos, hopefully this ends soon so I can go outside and shoot some content, either way I'll be here doing some kind of videos for you guys eventually, so thank you so much for watching, don't forget to subscribe and see you next time, love you!